that's something I've certainly been thinking about when thinking about the artificial intelligence and the conversation we've had is this fear, you know, this fear of the robots taking over, you know, our lives or our jobs. Um, as an AI ethicist, is there anything to say about that fear that, you know, probably has a lot of people worried? Yeah, yeah, that, it, it's, um, it's so true. Um, I'm concerned as well. I'm definitely concerned um, with some of these issues um, that I think, you know, are on our mind in terms of automation and, and what will happen to the future of work. Um, so in the courses, I mean, we start out with kind of like, what is ethics? We move into some of the things we've been talking about in terms of data, machine learning models, and how that works. And then the very last course is about robo-ethics. And to me, this is where we start to address some of the bigger societal questions around automation, around where we're going, around how technology is maybe pushing us to be more like it in certain ways. Um, we even have a bit of a conversation about uh, this idea of enhancing ourselves, you know, becoming cyborgs to a certain degree, using these technologies in ways that, you know, for some people might sound um, very sci-fi, but for other people, there, there are examples of people in the world who are already doing this and using these technologies in this way. Um, and so like through the four courses, we're kind of moving people along from what I would consider the basic building blocks um, towards kind of these um, bigger questions. We do also want to be careful, though, not to overhype um, the situation. Um, we try and set the um, issue of automation into a bigger context of what's been taking place for the last 100 years, uh, with the, starting with the Industrial Revolution, how automation came into businesses through assembly lines, traditional, let's call it traditional mechanical forms of automation that take place building cars, building machinery, all of that kind of stuff, and kind of leading into what's happening now with more intelligent um, AI-enabled systems and what that means for us. Um, I think the jury is out as to to what degree this will impact jobs and which jobs will it impact. Part of what I'm hoping is that when people take these courses, they will engage and have this conversation. They'll be informed, first of all, so that they can have an engaged conversation about this and help policymakers make some decisions about this. Because at the end of the day, living in a democracy, we should be having these conversations and asking our governments to make the appropriate regulations for what society wants to see happen. That's really what needs to happen. And so that's part of what we're trying to do with these courses and inform people enough so that they can help shape what the future should become. Yeah, no, I, I appreciate everything you've said. And I've, I'm certainly somewhat informed, but very intrigued to take the course myself and, and check this out and, and learn a lot more. Obviously, the, uh, the sky's the limit with the amount of learning on, on, on this information. So I, I appreciate your time. And I thank you very much for uh, informing me a bit about this. Fantastic. It's been fun. Thank you. Thank you.